On the evening of Friday, August 4th, dozens of trucks, tractors, and emergency vehicles gathered at Friendship Park for Orion Township's 20th annual Big Rig Gig. It's estimated that more than 1,500 families came out to the free event, making it the biggest and best Big Rig Gig ever. About 21 years ago, I had a baby boy who loved trucks. <laughs> so that's, I was looking for a new special event. Waterford had this event called Touch a Truck, and I'm like, yeah, let's check it out, see what it's like. I stole the idea, and 20 years later, here we are. Every year it gets a little bit bigger and a little bit better. I don't know if I'll be able to get better than a Chinook and the Oakland County Sheriff's Department helicopter. And How can you top that, Joe? How does it get better? But every year we come up with a better idea. This year we added food trucks. It's just every year businesses, they come to me, they want to come. I'm not going to turn them away. And here we are with the biggest big rig gig ever. For the 20th anniversary, Parks and Rec teamed up with the Orion Area Chamber of Commerce to include 10 additional food trucks, which turned out to be a huge hit with visitors. This year, the, for the third annual Food Truck Festival, we have partnered um, with Orion Township Big Rig Gig, and it is super successful. We have 10 food trucks out here today. Every single one of them has a long line, and the people in the pavilion are just enjoying big time. So it's a great collaboration. In addition to the big rigs, three different helicopters landed at Friendship Park, including this CH-47 Chinook out of Selfridge Air National Guard Base. Well, I mean, we're all, when we're all, when we're little kids, we want to do like cool stuff like this, so I'm happy to come out here and uh, show them that uh, there's uh, fun things to do when they grow up, although um, when you're a pilot, you never really grow up. So. <laughs> it's like you're playing G.I. Joe, right? Uh, yes, sir. <laughs> there's a lot, of, a lot of paperwork and behind the scenes, but uh, it is fun to come out and do the, do the good stuff once in a while. The Lake Orion Police Department has been involved with the big rig gig since the beginning, and this year they brought with them a wide variety of vehicles. The biggest thing we're trying to do is the joy of the kids. Um, the public, sometimes I with the kids, they're scared of us. We don't want them scared of us. They, we want them to approach us about anything and everything. And this breaks that barrier and, and uh, opens up a relationship, that type of thing. Anyone venturing over to explore the Orion Township Fire Department's vehicles had a chance to meet brand new Fire Chief Ryan Allen. The Chief was a former volunteer in Orion Township before moving to South Carolina and Oklahoma. He returned to Orion Township to begin his new gig on July 31st. I think it's a great event. We're seeing a lot of people out. We're able to welcome the public in, uh, other community. Uh, other places so it's been really nice it's really nice to see the community come and rally it's nice to see everybody be able to get out and couldn't ask for a better day to do it looks like you brought the whole fleet out what did you bring out today we did we've got uh, ambulances out here we brought an engine a ladder truck and a command vehicle so that people can see what their tax dollars are are going to work for because this is what we're all about joe um look at the families it's all about the families young families with kids older families I mean, there's, there's some just moms and dads here. You don't have to have a kid to be here. And everybody's smiling, everybody's happy. Because what's better than a, a park full of trucks? That's why we do it. It's really about bringing families together. Orion Township Parks and Rec will continue to offer family-friendly events throughout the summer, including their outdoor community garage sale on August 19th and concerts at Wildwood through August 22nd. For more information, visit orionparks.com. From Friendship Park, this is Joe Johnson reporting for ON TV News.